That's not looking bad, guys. Lovely enclosure lid now, all nicely marked out. Uh, obviously, the screen fits in here. And uh, I've got here a bunch of uh, long M3 screws, bolts, little plastic washers. It's, uh, it's not a three mil drill, it's a three and a half mil drill. So that gives us a little bit of wiggle room for the screws. And then here we've got a little countersink drill. Right, um, time for me to give the missus a shout because anyone seen one of these before? That, if you look at the chuck, that's a very, very fine chuck. So this little tiny, um, oh, that won't even fit in there. Doo -doo -doo. A little tiny uh, drill bit will fit in there and should be nice and straight when we spin it. Cool. Right, time to call the missus. Oh, honey. Right, the lovely Mrs. Dubious is here to help me with this. You ready? Go for it, honey. Let's see if we can uh, drill some relatively straight holes. It looks as though everything's lined up okay and everything's good. Making a countersink, um, or a precision countersink, not drilling too far in, uh, you know, not ruining things. Okay, guys and girls, so what have we got then? Uh, Raspberry Pi, the WaveShare screen, all plugged in. Admittedly, it's all a little bit sort of forced and squeezed in place at the moment. The screen is fitted to the wood. Did ooh, lovely wood. Got a power supply here. Press the on button. Ooh, look at that. And we get Raspberry Pi booting. And. Uh, We've got a controller, we've got RetroPie. I'm gonna turn the lighting off in here. And I'm gonna take a to see I don't have the ability to insert a coin. It's it's looking it's looking quite nice. It's not looking bad at all. I think if I were to pick that up and uh, and play on it. I think that would uh, definitely, definitely be quite cool. Okay. Do do do. Yeah. That'll work. That's not looking bad, guys. Sorry, you've got reflections in here and stuff like that. But that is looking okay guys, that's not looking bad at all, that's certainly playable. So, um, right, next step. Right then, we need to start putting the electronics together for this thing. Um, so before we do that, we've got to uh, fit various different sized little bullets, shells, um, into positions drill some holes in here so that we've got controls. The controls come from the internals of one of these. So inside one of these, there is one of those. And a few of these. Uh, so I just zoom in. 
So what we've got is we've got um, little uh, contact tracks here, which hopefully you can see. And then on the uh, back side of these pads here, we've got um, little conductive rubber press buttons that uh, when you press them down, when you press them, bonk, 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 there we go, bonk, 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 that um, shorts those uh, electrical connections together. And we have a little chip here, which uh, talks through USB. So what we've got to do is we've got to find a way of chopping this board up and uh, fitting the aspects of this board in the locations. So you can see I've marked up approximately where I want these to land and they don't interfere with the electronics. Hello! <laughs> Vicky's here to help me um, and what we're going to do is we're going to use the hand drill uh, to drill some holes of the appropriate sizes uh, and fit these little casings through them. Okay, then what we're going to do is we're going to use this guy here. He's going to put a little bit of a chamfer, uh, a bit of a counter bore on these. And we'll just do that manually, ever so slightly. I don't want that to be too big. Yep, so uh, that's that then. <laughs> Oops, let's see if we can get this out without causing any more damage. Oh man, that sucks. Tell you what guys, that sucks. But we can fix it. I will say though, I, uh, I nearly, I nearly used a few choice words. Anyway, a bit of wood glue and um, and a clamp, and I reckon we'll be back on track. Damn shame. Very frustrating. Anyway, there we go. These little challenges are, uh, are sent to try us, aren't they? One final thought. I should have stuck with the hand drill. <laughs> Got cheeky and tried to uh, tried to move things along too quickly. Righto, there it is. One of those, one of those. Big old clamp. <laughs> Look at this, British make. Let's see if we can uh, get this thing glued up and fixed. 